I get to shower with my wife every day. Oh, yeah. Too much information, dear. <laughs> you, know what? you have to laugh every day. Augie started Life Fitness when he was in college. You probably see his exercise equipment in nearly every gym you go to. Augie is all those words that people describe successful people by. Augie was arrogant. Augie was selfish. Business, love, he'll push the envelope. It's what he's known for. It's how he succeeded in life. And, you know, he'll push it to the point where he breaks. <laughs> Ten years ago, we were diagnosed with ALS. I hope you know nothing about ALS. It's the brain functioning without a body. The brain in solo flight. Everything was thought about in terms of when Augie dies. He tried to commit suicide. If he wanted to die, I understood it until you come to peace with the fact that you weren't designed to experience it all, and whatever peace you do get to experience, that's your gift. I'm going to beat this son of a bitch. I made the critical mistake of giving Augie my cell phone number and my home phone number. Augie's very direct and very aggressive. We have about 25, 30 drug development programs going on at any given time. There's no place like this in the world. We're trying to figure out a way to keep something alive. We don't have an enemy. He's taken all his marketing capability and sales capability and said, boy, this world of research is screwed up and we can do it better. Here's a guy who's in control of everything. We can see Ogie getting stronger. He's going to be an entrepreneur in the ALS field. He's the only one. He can change the way we think about this. He's learning how to be alive. And you actually think there's a chance that, that you can look this thing. <laughs> I, I don't think I can get up in the morning if I didn't think so.